Okay, let's go to London and do a photo shoot. Yeah. Welcome to my latest vlog. Yes, I'm out in central London again doing another photo shoot. Uh, yeah, today the video is going to be a little bit different because I'll be doing POV style. I got my new Insta360 Go 3. Uh, something that I've been eyeing on for a long time because I wanted to do this sort of POV thing for a while but I don't want to mount a GoPro on top of my camera that's kind of look ugly so um, I'm trying to do something quite discreet and quite similar so Go 3 it seems to be the perfect solution for it and at the moment I'm actually filming with it as well and I've already tested a few times and uh, doing this kind of vlogging style just to test out the audio and everything like that it's actually not too bad but if you guys want to see more about the Go 3 and uh, let me know in the comment section below, I may do a specific video just for that. Hi, can I have a, uh, a skinny latte? Take a baby with you. Here, please. Or do you have a plain croissant? Just a plain one? Yeah, can I have a plain, yeah, please. Skinny latte. Thank you. Okay, right. I have a uh, a big gap now between now and meeting my clients because uh, I specifically allow for more time, uh, just in case there are any delay in transportations and travel. And that indeed will happen this morning. So lucky that I allow for that, and so I'm here early still with all that delay. Um, yeah, I still got about forty five minutes uh, before my client turns up. So I'll well use this opportunity to tell you a little bit more about um, uh, you know uh, what I carry. Uh, what sort of lenses I use for these sort of portrait shoots? Uh, so that could be quite interesting. Uh, I hope that you guys would, uh, you know, have an idea when it comes to photographing portraits and things like what sort of lens I use, and also uh, for what kind of effect that I want to achieve. Um, so this is in part educational, maybe something that uh, you guys may be interesting about. But uh, also, you know, I want to use these opportunities, you know, if uh, in the future to do sort of POV style thing that I would like to show you around London as well. And uh, so if you want to, you know, see what I used to take my photos in all the landmark areas and uh, what sort of angle that I'll be using and uh, yes this could be quite interesting for you guys to check out um, then remember if you do uh, like this sort of thing remember to subscribe and give me a like as well um, anyway so uh, let's check out my camera bag coffee is always good in the morning this is my second cup already by the way so here we go, this is my work bag, it's the Billingham shoulder bag, this is the Inventor Mark II. I love this guy here because it's, um, first of all, durable, second, absolutely waterproof. Uh, you guys follow me around in this channel, you may have seen me walking in the rain, and yes, I do shoot in the rain a lot, especially in the winter time. Um, so I need something that is weatherproof, not just the camera, but also the bag as well, and this guy here is really is completely waterproof and you don't have to worry about a thing uh, you don't need to put on jacket you know like it's as it is it's just waterproof so brilliant for that very well padded very well protected uh, that's one of the reasons why i use a lot of Billingham's in my past and uh, this is currently my work favorite i've been using it for over a year now uh, on a daily basis and uh, so it's new <laughs> look kind of new to me and uh, but anyway uh, let's see what's inside here not trying to advertise Billingham, but uh, indeed I'm trying to endorse them just because I like the bags and uh, I don't have anything, I don't earn anything from them, I just like the bags in general. So here we go, let's uh, show you guys what's inside the bag. So inside the bag I usually would have uh, my 40 to 150 2.8 Pro for all the candid shots, so I want to compress the background a little bit and also some walking shot, you know, some natural movement shots, so that will be my go-to lens. Then I have the, of course, the um, 45 1.2 
mount it on my OM1 SLR uh, style Michael Four Foot body, and also I have the uh, 12 to 40 2.8 Pro, a zoom, general zoom that I can do all kinds of stuff, and a 25 1.2 Pro, uh, which is kind of my general purpose half lane shots. So that is a very very good lens there. Uh, yeah, generally this is kind of like my setup. Very simple um, four lenses. Occasionally, uh, I will swap the 12 to 41 uh, 2.8 Pro into a 17 millimeters 1.2 Pro, and that lens currently is in service. So hopefully I will get it back soon, and I will swap it back. So uh, yeah, so usually I have three 1.2 Pro prime lenses with me, and the 40 to 150 f 2.8 Pro. Um, so yeah, that will be more than sufficient to do all my jobs. Um, when it comes to you know like something like a more indoors uh, kind of uh, uh, confined area, I will usually uh, swap the 17 to even wider lens either going to be 12 or uh, the latest uh, Panasonic Leica like, uh, 9mm f1.7 and that is a brilliant lens and really good for low light and also ultra wide as well so I can get into really tight spaces and still get the angle that I need so that's it that's my simple kit uh, for all my professional jobs nothing really fancy you know like um, I don't shoot full frames anymore and this is more than enough as you can see and hopefully I'll show I'll be able to show you the uh, photos later so you can see exactly what sort of quality you can expect that for Michael for that system. Here we go. We, I'm meeting my clients here in Russell Square Park. I think this is always cool. And uh, this is the beautiful lady here, this Brianne. Hello, and her family. There you go. And you do design. Yes, interior design. So, in exchange for my permission to show the photos, <laughs> I'm going to bring her business into this channel here. So I'm going to put her um, uh, detail in the description below. And you do design. Yeah. Interior design. Interior design. Interior design. So if you are interested in upgrading your home. <laughs> yeah, to make it look posh and nice, that's the person. And which area it is? So we primarily work um, in Chicago, yep. but we've done projects all over the country and one in Spain. One in Spain. Spanish people. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> all right, let's cracking. you got a bright spot on your chest. <laughs> wow, that's nice. Very good. Okay, here we go. One, two, three. Okay, let's start off from here. Actually, I'm, I like the curve here, so yeah. I would like you to be on this side, but this side you've got the kind of line of shadow there. We can try one first to see what happens. So you can start off here as a family in a line. You're just going to walk towards me, okay? So I'll wave at you when I'm ready. I just need to angle yourself. Okay, ready? Yep, just come forward. Okay, got it, got it. That was nice. <laughs> oh, that's a lovely shot. That's a nice shot. I like that. I like that a lot. Just to show you quickly. Oh my gosh, that's so cute. There you go. You see I yourself. Love it. There's the Christmas card right there. That's a wrap. <laughs> <laughs> that's a wrap. Okay, we're gonna do some more. Okay, you come over here. You short enough just before you touch the leaf. Okay, use your back. Lean over. Okay, on this side. On this side. Okay, let's see. Oh, uh, you are sweet. There you go, let's do one like that. That's beautiful. Okay, let's do one more. Okay, that's nice. Very nice. Okay, one, two, three. Oh gosh. <laughs> right, hopefully you die down a little bit more. Okay. Great. Oh, you want to get? Oh, I know it's daddy's girl. <laughs> All right. Okay. Let's do one like this. <laughs> That's nice. Brilliant. Okay. Let's do one more. I'm going to do a full body shot. Oh, that's great. Excellent. Let's do one more. I want Brienne to join as well. This is a lovely area here, that's nice. One, two, three. And look at each other. Ah, oh, that's great. Awesome. Yeah, I think I think I think it'll work well with your your, your light outfit. Yeah. I think it would be quite nice. So um Okay. So if you guys can go here, so there are a couple of styles I can do. You can either sit on the steps 
or you can one stand on each different levels and um, you're the smallest okay yes you are <laughs> but eat more vegetable you grow as tall as mummy very soon very soon be taller than me yeah Okay, so let's maybe let's do a fun one here. So Jeff, I think you can kind of lean over here. Yeah. Yeah. Put one leg on uh, on um, on on there. Yeah. Hands in pocket. You go on that side, and you're in the middle. So you can strike a pose. <laughs> you're happy. Okay, that's good. That's a very nice, elegant lady look. That's good. Well, I'm gonna have to shift on the other side. So uh, just one second. Okay, ready guys? There we go, one, two, three. Okay. We can also do one, you can stand by the door, and then... Okay, so I'm gonna change the lens. Okay, now I've got a longer lens. So move this way a little bit more. Okay, perfect, that's good, right. Okay, right, one more time. Okay, you guys ready? That's nice. One, two, three. Beautiful. Let's do one more. Okay, one, two, three. Smiley. Ah, that was one. <laughs> this is also a quite cute spot for another walking one as well. So, uh, this is, I like this street here. That's kind of nice. Yeah. If you walk to the end of this, uh, just end of the, um, the fence here and start walking towards me. Okay. Yep, yeah, I'm gonna wait here. Okay, here we go. Some candid one. Let's try this. <laughs> Got a shot. Brilliant. Okay, that's good. Let's see this then. Oh, no, definitely not like this. Okay, let's do it the other way. So then. Oh yes, better now. Oh, that's great. Okay, one, two, three. Okay, that's one more. Okay, I'm gonna do a full body. Okay. Brilliant, that's good. Okay, let's do one more. Okay, sit down. Okay, let's see. Oh, that's a nice one. Okay, you have to do your hair a little bit. This side, just a bit more straighter. Okay. Let's see, you're looking beautiful. There you go. Right. Oh, that's nice. Very nice. So let's see the head shot. So this will be up to here. Head. Okay. So this way a bit more. Stand up. No, stand over this. Okay, turn your body a little bit. Back. Okay. Right. Okay. Let's do that one more time. Okay, one more shot. Okay, one second. If you just elevate me just a little bit more. Okay, there we go. Okay, got it. <laughs> Wonderful. So much fun. So the photo shoot had just been concluded and Brienne and her family was amazing. Amazing. Beautiful and amazing. We got some really nice shots as you can see in the video already. Uh, so yeah, this is basically what I do on a daily basis. Um, yeah, I hope that this POV video will be useful and also educational at the same time for you guys uh, and learn more about portrait photography and photographing people and, uh, and also in a way just to show you what I can achieve with my lenses and my camera. You don't need really fancy gears to be quite honest. Michael Forther is plenty enough to do anything that I wanted to do. Uh, yeah, that's it. So if you enjoyed this video, remember to give me a thumb and a like and also uh, yeah, subscribe to the channel if you want to stay tuned and to see more of this type of video. If there is anything you would like to learn more, uh, please do leave me some comment in the sort of comment section below. And don't forget to check out Brienne's um, uh, Instagram and also her website uh, if you're into uh, interior design and also maybe if you want to done up, upgrade your house wherever she operates, Spain. <laughs> okay, anyway, I'll see you all later and uh, until next time, have a great day. Peace.
Welcome to my bonus section and uh, just a quick note about uh, what I'm filming. I think I'm actually pretty impressed with the Insta Go 3 and uh, it's actually quite amazing as a vlogging camera. Uh, the audio actually surprisingly good if you got close enough distance like this. Uh, it works really well I somehow kind of uh, it's not a directional thing but then um, it, it actually pick up my voice really good as well it doesn't have that kind of tinny sound it's uh, it's you know some processing they have done that make it sound good and uh, as a kind of vlogging kind of casual videoing tool this is actually pretty good and I do like the uh, dependent that you can stick into my chest which I did use it throughout the entire day today uh, which is amazing um, yeah it's really really interesting so if you want to learn more about Insta Go 3 I may do a separate video on that but apart from that let me know in the comment section below as well you know what do you think about the Insta Go 3 to me it's going to be with me for a while. I think uh, this little camera here is going to help me do these POV videos. And, uh, I, I think it's actually a really, really good tool. So, have a good day. Good day. Good day. <laughs> See you later all. Have a good day then. Bye now.